besondere Herausforderung sicherlich, diese Konferenz zu organisieren, war, dass natürlich viele der Teilnehmenden aus Ländern kommen, die von extremer Überwachung und einem Polizeistaat und noch, noch schlimmer aus Kriegskontexten gekennzeichnet sind. One of our topics from the conference was to look at what kind of more negative impact really European policies have on the region, like the whole issue of um, cooperating with authoritarian regimes on issues like migration, uh, fighting terrorism and thereby authoritarian regimes are strengthened and the emancipatory forces are weakened. Many are suffering from repression, so it was very important to open a safe space for those who struggle for social change, who struggle for more social justice. Security is one issue that this conference provides a maneuver around because we can face to face say things that we might not be able to communicate via the normal ways and tools provided. So reaching out for allies is not easy and is not allowed and is not possible. And this is where actually also we're learning from each other. We're all being faced with uh, very harsh security forces and that's also where the common realities intersect. Although the political systems are different, the social structures are different, there are patterns of uh, policies that cause injustice um, that have come across different countries of the region, transformed societies in a certain way. And this pattern, specifically I'm referring to the neoliberal wave of economic policies supported by international financial institutions uh, that has limited the policy space of the countries, that has caused new social problems, old social problems to be reproduced again because of these policies, and that they are interconnected with other kind of injustices related to gender or race or geographical residence. These thematics seems like to be far from each other, but in a way they are very connected and they are, they are very interlinked. A uh, conference like this gives you the possibility to first hear what's happening in other places, in other contexts, and really gives you the possibility to connect and like to try maybe to do something together. The youth, they motivate each other and they learn from their experience to how to face these um, uh, authoritarian regimes and dictatorship regimes. From today until tomorrow, I feel that I know them from a long time. So I feel that we are a united group, you know, and this is one of the strong points that I get from this conference. Als Forscherin eher in der Position, ähm, Wissen zu vermitteln, Wissen in Frage zu stellen ähm, und vielleicht auch nochmal den Diskurs zu verändern. Ich glaube, das ist das, was ich äh, von meiner Seite tun möchte oder versuche zu tun zumindest. Ähm, und ansonsten ist es natürlich auch ganz zentral, dass sozusagen aus der Perspektive des globalen Nordens es auch nochmal wichtig ist, sich die Frage zu stellen, wie können meine Solidaritätsbestrebungen wirklich auf Augenhöhe bleiben. Also dass ich nicht aus einer paternalistischen Position heraus versuche, den Menschen zu helfen, dass ich sie aber auch nicht in, ein, in Gefahr bringe. Also das sind sozusagen, glaube ich, die zwei größten Herausforderungen. Specifically, what keeps coming to my mind with each discussion that we need people here and everywhere in Europe to pressure more the governments. That's the kind of solidarity and protection they can provide and that's actually the kind of just world that we need to live in where we hold our own governments accountable. We can deal with the dictatorship we're living with if it's receiving less support from Europe and the US and the Western governments. So during our conference, we came up with very interesting results and we wanted to share this with a bigger audience. One on the intersecting crisis the regions faces and how they impact the populations and how they impact on, on, on those who are agents for change, the activists, the academics. And of course, um, the, our other important issue was on how we can build solidarity and what is needed. So our role would be to make the concerns of people in other countries our very own concern and lobby our government to respect human rights and not make negotiations with 
dictators who violate human rights. Ich habe ganz viele Stimmen gehört von Teilnehmenden, die sagen, so etwas habe ich noch nie erlebt. Dass ich mit solchen Leuten auf so einer Konferenz sprechen kann, das ist einmalig. Und das war ja genau das, was im Zentrum dieser Konferenz stand, zu schauen, wie kann ich irgendwie erreichen, dass über diese Grenzen hinweg Solidarität geschaffen werden kann. It all shows us that it is very important to connect resistances, to, to enable activists and, and academics to, to exchange and to, to, to show solidarity also and to see how we can show more solidarity and, and connect with each other. So, so the question now is how to continue and how to enable the activists to continue without us and maybe see where we can play a role.